In this video, we're going to discuss the difference between intrinsic motivation and extrinsic motivation. To begin, you're going to find motivation as the desire or willingness to exert mental or physical effort toward a goal. We've all heard about this before. How motivated are you to do something? All right, you might be very motivated to do well in your MCAT, so that way you have a good chance of getting into medical school. Or you might be motivated to go exercise because you enjoy playing sports. All right? This is looking at the different ways that people are motivated. And one way we categorize the difference is by whether the motivation is intrinsic or extrinsic. Intrinsic motivation is an incentive to engage in a specific activity that derives from personal enjoyment, satisfaction, or feeling of achievement. Right? In this case, you're doing it because you want to. All right? So this could be a student that reads a physics book because she finds the concepts fascinating. She enjoys reading the book, and she's not reading the book for some other purpose. All right? So the key thing is they're doing it because they want to. Now, if we take a look at extrinsic motivation, we can define this as an external incentive to engage in a specific activity to obtain a reward or avoid a punishment. All right, so key thing here, it's external. So as an example, you can have a student that studies for an exam because they will lose their scholarship if they get a bad grade. All right, so they're studying not because they want to, but because they're trying to avoid this punishment losing their scholarship if they get a bad grade. Another example, you have a student that is asked to represent their school in a spelling bee. Even though the student dislikes competing in public, the student agrees to do it because if they did not participate, they would feel guilty for not representing their school. All right? Now, this sounds a little bit like it's internal because they're talking about feeling guilty, but this is still extrinsic motivation because the student is not participating in the spelling bee because they want to, right? They're doing it because of some external reason. That external reason is they're told that they would be representing the school. And if they didn't, then that would make the student feel guilty. So it's extrinsic, not intrinsic. And finally, a student volunteers on the weekend because it is important for him to get into college. Again, this is extrinsic because the student isn't volunteering because they want to. They're volunteering in order to get a reward, which is get accepted into college. All right, so hopefully that helps you understand the difference between extrinsic and intrinsic motivation.